us a blow Seen your pretty as soon as you came in that door I just wanted hey you guys. Um, I wanted to do a talk through video because I've got a lot of new products that I wanted to try out and instead of doing a haul I thought let me just film the video so that you guys can see what it looks like and I can do like a mini review of each of the products as well so yes I've already done my brows but first of all I'm going to talk about my new foundation <laughs> and this is the Lancome I know you guys have you guys not noticed that I've been looking for a foundation for like I don't know since like December like I've been looking for a new foundation and I finally found one so this is the Lancome um, Tante Miracle when I did purchase it they gave me the Energy Divi <laughs> gave me this cream and um, I'm not even sure what it's for but we'll see how it goes um, glow boosting so I'm gonna put this on oh this feels really nice it feels like a little like serum -y gel type thing it feels really nice and my skin's been getting like so dry recently so hopefully like this helps moisturize it up now this new product it looks so dirty but it is the NYX pore filler and when I first got this product I was like why is it pink do they not know that I'm black like why is it pink <laughs> So, um, but yeah, it actually works. I think the pinkness actually changes the colour of the pores, but it really does fill them pores because I still haven't found a product that actually removes, um, like, my pores. Yeah, so I've rubbed the pore filler into my skin. And this is what the foundation looks like. Um, I got it in an 11, which is quite dark, but um, it is going to be summertime, so... Might as well get it in a darker colour. But look at the packaging, like, oh, it's so cute. Yeah. So, I'm just going to put some, to put two pumps on the back of my hand. Oh, that might have been a bit too much. And then, like, dot it on my face. There we go. And I'm just going to use my dirty beauty blender to blend out. So now I'm going to move on to my eyes and I'm going to use my So, and this is a new, is it new in, or I don't even know what I'm going to name it, but it is, what I have recently bought is the Zoeva um, Cocoa Blend Palette, and it looks like this. I just thought these colours were gorgeous for the springtime, so I said, let me just get it, just get it. But it's just gorgeous. Look at all of that. I love that colour. Then I'm going to take my MAC 217 brush and I'm not actually going to start off with that, but because I want it to be like an orangey kind of fresh look, I'm going to use my, what do you call it? This eyeshadow colour color from MAC and it's called Raw. And I'm going to just go into my crease with it like a burnt orange kind of colour now I'm gonna go in with what's it called substitute for love which is the colour next to like the deep kind of fresh blue toasty colour that's what it's called 
cold. Um, and I'm just gonna put that just under where I put roll. Then I'm gonna change my brush and I'm using the Morphe N330 brush and I'm gonna take freshly to toasted just to deepen up the crease. Okay guys, I'm back. I've got this little like kind of definer brush and it's quite flat so it's going to help me pack on the colour a bit more. So I'm just spraying that with some Fix Plus and then I'm going to carry on adding pure ganache. So now I'm just going to do the other eye and then I'm going to carry on. Ah! So it looks proper together right now, but I'm going to add some mascara and then let it dry and then um, go and do my contour. And I've got a new product for contour. Oh, I'm just using the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Extra Black. Because you know I need the Extra Black. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to highlight my face using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in Toffee. Then for my nose, I've started to use a brush to blend out the highlight on my nose so that it, it makes the highlight part more defined instead of it being blended like everything else. And then the new product that I'm using to contour, it's still from my trusty sleek, but it is the new, what's it called, cream contour kit. And I got it in dark and it comes with a little pamphlet telling you how to contour highlight slash whatever, but um, I am not going to be using that. And it comes with six shades and they look like this. So it looks like that. And... I don't even know what to use, <laughs> like, I really don't know what to use. I'm thinking I might be a mixture between these two because that one looks proper dark to be using. And I also got a new brush as well, um, and it's this one from, I just think I just got it on eBay, but it's just a flat top contour brush. I still might use my Raw Techniques one because I think, I just think it's better. But we'll see how it goes, I'll use it and see. I just remembered that I forgot to set my concealer before it starts sweating everywhere, so let me set that first. I'm going to use the brush that I just got, which is the E30 brush, and I'm going to use that to actually put the contour on my face. I 
back for us to roll Married to the money, introduce him to my stove Showed him I don't whip him now Sorry about that, my camera cut out. So what I was gonna do was to define the contour a bit more. I was going to go back into my sleek face form and set it, but also add a bit more contour to it. I'm gonna set um, underneath my contour. And then I'm just gonna dust it off with a semi-clean buffing brush. But I'm going to highlight, I guess what I'm highlighting with guys. Oh, I finally got it. I got the Anastasia glow kit in that glow. Keep, keep, look at my face. Just highlight. You can see already. Oh, come on. So I just do it like that. Add some more. Oh, to keep his bay. Bit on my chin. Nose, just at the bottom. There. But it just like literally finished. Sorry guys, again, um, but I'm just doing my wings liner. I've done one and I'm just doing the other. Now I'm going to add some lashes and I'm using the new Ardell um, Double Wispy Lashes. And I got these from False Lashes UK as usual and look how gorgeous they are. Normally I use the Demi Wispy, so I just wanna show a comparison to what they look like. So these, are the Demi Wispies um, and these are the Double Wispies so it's just a lot more fuller a lot more wispier so I'm really excited to try these so that's those on and then I'm going to add some mascara on the bottom lashes And then I'm going to go on to lips. I'm lining my lips with stone. Um, the stone lip liner by MAC. Because I feel like I do like a grey nude. And then I'm going to use, I'm going to use Among the Fireflies, which is a cream sheen finish by MAC. It's just a nice purpley pink nude. So I'm going to go back into my Zoe Eva Cocoa Blend palette and I'm going to add freshly toasted um, just to my under eyes. And then I'm going to add some more of the, um, some more of pure ganache to the inner tear ducts. So this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope this is a look that you'd recreate for your like spring and summer time like makeup looks. Please subscribe to my channel and please like this video. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!